you get into a rhythm, it's hard to stop. Right now, we've got a great rhythm going at the University of Louisville. It's the right beat, the perfect pace, moving us in the right direction. A trip to the Sugar Bowl was sweet topping on a great 2012. We celebrated the restoration of an icon. The thinker embodies the work we do as a university. We continued to beat the drum for federal research grants, earning close to 200 million bucks in 2012. Doctors, uh, researchers, clinicians, uh, work together in collaboration. They create new knowledge, new ways of diagnosing disease, but more importantly, new ways of treating disease. We continued the charge of making campus a great place to study, live, work, and play, with groundbreaking on a new $37.5 million rec center on the west side of campus. To ensure that students' voices were heard, to ensure that this represented the voice of the students, the desires of the students, the wishes of the students, to ensure that all of that took place, um, it didn't matter what we were giving up to have those discussions, it was worth it. And while our men's basketball team squared off at the Final Four in New Orleans, our students were celebrating the achievements back home on campus. We continued the charge of making our community a better one. The Signature Partnership celebrated five years of lending a hand, reaching out to those in need. Since 2007, over 3,000 UofL students and over 400 U of L faculty and staff have worked with 79 different community partnerships to provide services that are a benefit to the people of West Louisville. We began work on an access road that will lead to a new 39-acre research park behind the Speed School of Engineering on land where the old Kentucky Trailer Company used to be. We opened doors to the first Shelby Hearst office building, which continues the development of our great asset on the east side of town. We celebrated downtown, too, with the topping off of the Nucleus Innovation Park. University of Louisville and our wholly owned subsidiary Nucleus are committed to sustainability. We're committed to economic development, and those two do go hand in hand. We continue to partner with world-class companies, many of whom also call Louisville home, like General Electric. This is the first agreement of its kind we've had in Kentucky, streamlining the research process between GE and UofL's engineering and physics schools to help us get better leadership products to the market faster. Our students continue to be world-class as well, with eight Fulbright Scholars, 36 in the past three years, more than Duke, Notre Dame, and Emory. Those scholars and all of our students continue to hear from world leaders who come to our campus. Now the people that we've gotten to see from uh, our freshman year starting out with Chief Justice John Roberts, uh, we've seen um, uh, Senator McCain, um, Vice President Biden, Secretary Clinton. I mean, the people, when you look back, it's just unreal, uh, the opportunities that we've been given. The beat continued with the announcement of a partnership between U of L, University Hospital, and Kentucky One Health, securing the future of health care for the people of our community. Kentucky One will provide to both UMC and the University of Louisville, ensure that we can continue to be a leader in medical education, medical research, while providing the very best in clinical care. And we marched into a new conference, the ACC, a perfect fit for our sports teams, and just as importantly, verifying the upward trajectory of our academic profile as we join other great academic institutions. It's our job as athletic administrators, as university administrators, as people that are members of this wonderful community to change with it. And, and I think this opportunity coming forth for us, we couldn't ask for a better fit. A year in rhythm, and the beat goes on. Maybe even bigger and stronger 2013.